This video explains what incident edges are, how it is used in graph theory and includes an exercise to practice this. What are incident edges? Graph, vertex and edge are terms from graph theory. Common synonyms are network, node and link respectively. What are incident edges in graph theory? Edges are incident if there is a vertex between these edges. In this undirected graph, for example, the edges 1 and 2 are incident to each other because they share vertex B. 1 and 3 are non-incident edges because they have no common vertex. Adjacent and incident are often used as synonyms in graph theory. Usually one speaks of adjacent vertices, but of incident edges. However, some say adjacent edges. Vertices are adjacent if there is an edge between these vertices. Not only edges, but vertices can also be incident with an edge. A vertex is incident with an edge if the vertex is one of the endpoints of that edge. In the example graph the edge 1 is incident to vertices A and B. Also, we can say that vertex A is incident to edge 1 and vertex B is incident to edge 1. The incident edges have different applications. The total number of edges incident on a vertex is the degree of that vertex. A second application is in the edge cover. This means that each vertex in the graph touches at least one of the edges in the edge covering set. Usually, you want to know the smallest possible edge cover. Another use of the incident edge is the edge coloring problem. All edges need to fill with color such that no two incident edges have the same color. Suppose you have a problem where all edges must be a different color and you want to minimize this. What are the minimal number of colors to color the edges in this example graph? Edge 3 could not be blue or green. Because the maximum degree of a vertex is 3 in this graph, you need at least 3 colors to solve this edge coloring problem. A related concept is the incidence matrix of a graph. This matrix shows the relationship between vertices and the edges of a graph. An element is one if a vertex and edge are incident and zero if they are not. In this video we saw it's all about the endpoints of an edge. The incident edges concept has interesting applications. The terminology can be confusing at times. Usually adjacent or incident are not used for both vertices and edges. But one speaks of incident edges and adjacent vertices.